Here we go. Very double. You bastard! Friendly fire! Wait a minute. How you just gonna slap your opponent and the referee? Cause fuck them, that's why. Two for one special. His first mistake was taking the position of special guest referee. You never grew up watching WWE? You can get hands too, pussy! It's my turn! Ah! Jesus Christ. Lord of mercy, my baby! Are you okay? The fuck you think? That shit hurt. Some of them going to sleep. Fuck that! It's my turn! Almost slapped the mustache off that boy. What's killing me is the fact that homie done bent the knee, squatted down to his opponent's eye level in an effort to activate maximum torque to slap the tampico juice out this man. He slapped the hell out the prefrontal cortex. I wonder what homie got on his mind. <laughs> On your face, man. We should have known homie was a menace. Look at him biting his lower lip. Nobody does that unless they have nefarious intent in mind. All jokes aside, what kind of organization is this? Why the referees also on camera duty? Ref on the left, live on Instagram. Ref on the right, coming in live on Facebook. Who the hell officiates the fights? The fans? <laughs> Wait a minute, how homie hit the floor faster than the cotton that was supposed to protect his ear? I don't know! This long bearded dude look kinda dangerous. I'll fucking do it again. Okay. <laughs> God damn! So this man just gonna sleep two people in the same day? All he did was change shirts, but sent both his opponents to the same ICU? Oh my God. Jesus. Now that I think about it, this dude looked kind of familiar. Take this. The slap took him to the old saloon. This man is riding a mechanical bull. He lost his trucker hat and equilibrium in one second. That's right. He goes by the crazy Hawaiian and he was in my last video, but I forgot the conclusion of the fight. It's over. Oh, my God. Ah! Not only did he knock his hat off, he hit the southern pride out that man. Woke up a resident of North Dakota. Oh, fucking do it again. Okay. Say something, say something. Talk. Talk to me, talk to me. Are you okay? Oh, Honey, are you okay? How many fingers do I have up? 17. Oh, Lord, he's a vegetable. Every time I've seen this man slapping somebody, he leaves the match with a victory. Is that Pete Davidson? Ric Flair? If that ain't the weirdest combination of human beings? Stop hitting yourself! Stop hitting yourself! The Hawaiian made it to pay-per-view! You what the fuck was that? that? This man's hair is colored like people from Planet Namek. Send him to the Shadow Realm! What's going on? Is the light too bright for these brothers? Ric Flair get in the vicinity and all of a sudden can't nobody deliver. I think playtime is over. He put his heart and soul into that and the Hawaiian only took three damage. Come at me, bro! Careful. You might get exactly what you wish for. No! 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 Hell, son, there ain't but one belt in the Federation that I'm interested in. You are looking at the next champion, and that's the bottom line, the Stone Cold Sexton. Dropped his life points down to zero, put that man to sleep. Turns out the crazy Hawaiian was only putting on for the cameras, letting the people believe this was an equal fight. Come here. Homie got slapped so hard he forgot Hawaii was a state. Woke up thinking he got knocked out by an immigrant. I've never seen this man lose. Who's gonna stop the crazy Hawaiian? And although that brother ears is swollen, there's still enough space to fit in his Raycons. And now a word from our sponsors. Wait a minute, how are you listening to this video right now? Let me make it a bit more pristine and introduce you to these Raycon Everyday Earbuds. Raycon's everyday earbuds look, feel, and sound better than ever with optimized gel tips for the perfect in-ear fit. These earbuds are so comfortable and they will not, will never budge. Trust me, never budging. They offer eight hours of playtime and 32-hour battery life. 32 hours, that's longer than a day. 
And just look at the different colors. Look at the different flavors. And Raycons are priced just right, so you'll get quality audio at half the price of other premium audio brands. It's no wonder that Raycon's everyday earbuds have over 48,000 five-star reviews. So what are you waiting for? Click the links in my description. Go to buyraycon.com slash chisel and get 15% off your very next Raycon order. That's buyraycon.com slash chisel. Get 15% off your very next Raycon purchase. Go increase your audio quality today the Raycon way. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. After taking down green-haired Dodoria, the crazy Hawaiian would get the opportunity of a lifetime as he'd take on the reigning, defending, undisputed, slap-fighting champion of the world, the Polish Nightmare Zales. Not today! Oh, even the world champion can't provide any damage, and the challenger's fired up. He wants to slap the champion. Let me bang, man. The crazy Hawaiian begging the champion to untuck his chin, or lack thereof. Where is his neck located? His Adam's apple's in a maximum security prison. He's malfunctioning! He's malfunctioning! System error. It's my turn! Stupid, I'm not gonna let you get the chance. Ultimate defense! The champion takes no damage! Bullshit, bro. The crazy Hawaiian is claiming there's unjust actions being taken by the champion. I don't see any USA reps. That's what I don't see. Claims of international collusion and privilege are brought to the forefront. The lack of an American presence on the officiating crew makes the Hawaiian a bit concerned. Access denied. And in spite of his claim disadvantage, he still takes no damage. Some may claim he's a metapod using Harden. Metapod. But others know it's the power of the Hawaiian fupa. Rosetta Stone Polish, motherfucker. Translation. I ain't worried about no stupid American. How dare you? The crowd would give him strength like Goku summoning a spirit bomb. Time to hit the Polishman with the United States of Slap. The Polishman is rattled. The champion is on the ropes. The challenger has the advantage. USA, 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 USA. The crowd is going wild. A new champion is on the horizon. We coming for you, nigga. The crazy Hawaiian has all the confidence in the world going into round three. Rosetta Stone, Polish again, motherfucker. Translation, foolish American. I am champion for a reason. Oh my God! Jesus! Oh my God! The man stole the stock crap! That's it, he's dead! What did we just see? What did we just see? And welcome to your first day in the Kumite! Oh! No! This motherfucker's dead! Wait a minute! He slapped the Hawaiian poi out that man! Had him daydreaming of sunbathing on Punalulu Beach! What you gonna do? <laughs> I apologize for my outburst. The crazy Hawaiian sealed his fate when he vowed to do this competition without his patented hat. He was doomed from the start in enemy territory. The world against him. Why wasn't he wearing his hat? Look at the crew designated to catch his lifeless carcass, celebrating before he even hit the floor. Not slap the hell out. That's what just happened. But this is down. He thought the beard could carry him to the championship, but all it did was get him on the revamped season 12 of Duck Dynasty. He got knocked out from the east to the west. Back to the east. Back to the west. Call the ambulance. Pick up well, your people. Oh, Lord. They're bringing out the stretcher. He's going to leave here walking out of here like a man. Like the man that he is. Forget the stretcher. He's walking out a warrior, and he'll live to slap another day. And still, slap fighting world's super heavyweight champion, the Polish nightmare, Dawid Zales. Zalewski! Finish him! Snake, are you okay? Snake? Snake? Get this man to a hospital. Now! I'm ready to get a doctor out of here! Don't just stand there! Get a doctor out of here right now! EMTs, get him out of here!